at the dollhouse. Maybe. That's amazing. Hey, wait. So he's walking out. Hey, so his his overnight guy. Yes. Is walking out of the strip club with him, uh-huh. and I and so go, that guy Kurt Kelly you've been talking about, and I've been telling my friends, this is the guy I want to work for. He goes, he just walked out. I went, where? What? I went, uh, what? I, I ripped open the door. I went, you Kurt. Kurt? I said, you're Kurt Kelly? I said, you're a fucking asshole. <laughs> Shit. Straight up. I've been calling your ass. I've been, been leaving your right? fucking ass voicemails. Guess what? You have to know how many thousands of calls oh, I got when I put my home hey, number on here. Guess oh what? Oh my god. Hire me, put me on the air the next day. Good for you, man. True. That's amazing. True Fuck, story. I love that. I forgot and about that. By the way, I wish you would have changed the club. Maybe it was a dance club. <laughs> well, it was a dance club. Now it's a, Maybe change the story a little so it's no, not the dance club. No, that was a No, that was the truth. No, I'd rather, I'd rather have the truth. I'd rather have the truth. That is the truth. That's what we That's amazing. Well, do you, Come on, I was young and single. Did you say you're producer for television and film? Uh, we shot 3,000 episodes of television last year and released 300. Do you okay? Uh, we did are you at a certain studio? What are you? I have my own studio. That's amazing. We have offices worldwide. <laughs> do you do sitcoms? Yeah, you can. On Saturday Night Live, uh, twice, three times. It's like Moscow. impossible to get on that goddamn show unless Not you're for in. Me. Well, you're Kirk Kelly, okay? You're well, Kirk I've Kelly. also done this 47 years. Absolutely, you've done your time. I started when I worked in the That's incredible. I love LA. You never fucking know who you're gonna be. You true. know, it's amazing. Well, see, I look at it differently. Wherever I go, I always introduce myself. Those who follow up, I know they're real. Those who don't, I don't give a shit. All right, Kirk Kelly, you're gonna hear from me. Well, I guess I better get your contact info. Well, you know what? You're not gonna forget me, so. Do you have. Oh, fuck. I don't bring my fucking business cards with me because I'm an idiot. That's okay, I brought my fucking phone. Because <laughs> I'm smart. <laughs> Everyone has a cell phone. Just saying. It's not the age of business cards anymore. Well, I mean it is, but it's I'm not, also you know doing I mean? films on global warming, so to hand up business cards sounds. Yeah, I know, right? Here, it's a waste of paper. I didn't do it. Yeah, let me kill another tree I'm trying to save. <laughs> Uh, okay, so event is your birthday. I'm sure you have one. July 25th. And I pray you're over 21. I am 25. Well, there you go. I this is fun. You. How do I do this? Ooh, baby. Woo! Would you look at me and show Technology. you? Technology! Let me show you how to do it. <laughs> yeah. July. Wait, how did. Whoa. Yeah. I'm like in a whole other world right yeah. now. Wait, can I go down? Welcome this to Android. Is can I go down? Yes, you can. <laughs> as low as you'd like. Yeah. I won't complain. <laughs> I'll save that moment right now. <laughs> By the way, I should warn you, we've been videotaping all of this. Amazing! I can, yeah. I'm so happy about it. Smile. No. Oh, oh where? Right here? Hi. Oh my god! So you won't forget who I am. I was going to take a picture in your oh, you phone. So can, so to speak. <laughs> so. What do you do? I'm an actress. Aside from me, what do you do? <laughs> what do I do? Aside from you? Aside from you? Well, I'm an actress. I do sitcoms. I do a lot of improv. Oh. Um, I'm graduating from a professional conservatory. Which one? Uh, the Art of Acting. It's a Stella Adler. It's not this. The Stella Adler Studio. I blah, know blah, the Stella Adler people well. Right. So, do you know Dan Shaner? He's yeah. a casting director. Very close with him. He's one of my teachers. Okay, He's, who's your manager? I don't have an agent. Oh, I, I'm fresh. I, I know some people I yeah. could introduce you to. I, don't, I would I love don't that. Because I produce, and there would be a conflict. Uh, like this. Yes. God, I swear to God, I'm young enough to know how to use things. Uh, I would think so. You guys grew up with this shit. Except, like, I no. My I generation, I invented it for you guys. I do a lot of technology. Oh my God. You're like the and man of many things. And insult and I'm going to put, what is this, W? I'm going to put a notice here. We do. And beautiful, you add, beautiful blonde. Yeah. Yeah. Take a picture. Oh. Yes. I'm gonna put a picture in here. Or you can do a video, okay, whichever you prefer. Okay, oh, that's what do I do? Yeah, We're gonna do a picture there together. Aww. 
God, I love that cologne. What is it? I'm not wearing cologne. Oh, no, I'm wearing Marc Jacobs <laughs> Daisy. Look it? how cute I am. How do I do it? See? Just say it. Okay. I love that. Let me send you some. Oh, oh that's what it would appear we're so call. cute. Look at that. Favorite that shit. I already did. The star is a favorite. You just became a favorite. Now I'll send you something. I don't know. Just be send you that. Leo. Leo. Are you Apple or Android? I'm Apple. Oh, fuck. Do you, you like Android me, you, better? Well, yeah, because there's security oh. issues. I, I deal what? With. Yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. So I should switch to Samsung? Well, if you want to have security on your shit, yeah. <laughs> yeah, kind of. And then encrypt it. Uh, hang on, let me send you something else then. Uh, that's not it. Oh. How do you do this? How do you see it? I would get so confused with this. There's so many things. There I am. Yeah, but I'm going to send you something else. I'm just looking for who I sent it to. Oh, no, that's not it. Leo! Uh, that's it. This, if you put it into your contacts at the end, it has about 60 meg. It's a huge file. Oh, shit. Uh, it has every company, well, a lot of the companies I own worldwide. Oh, that's amazing. And so you just import it and double click on it and save it in your contacts. I love Samsung. I gotta get one of these fucking and things. So if you were to do like this, when you import it, it should look like... <coughs> Excuse me. You have your own name saved in your phone? Well, yeah, a I card so I can send it to people. <laughs> so when they get it, when they open it, a few more. Yeah, start, you get all start, of to, start to scroll. Holy see how long fuck. Is. What am I going to look at, Kurt? Holy shit. These are all numbers that reach me I'm calling your home phone. Email and it can pull up plenty which one it is. <laughs> Keep going. I will call. Tell me when you I'll be like Scott. Tell I'll me just, when you hit the end. I'll just call every phone number possible. Tell me when you hit the end. Okay. I'm just going to call every number. See, it has addresses Holy worldwide, <laughs> affiliate information. Here, what do you do with all of this? This is how you find me in the world. God, Jesus fucking Christ. Now you know why 50 million people follow me each week. I do a lot of shit. Yeah, obviously. Fuck. Oh, I got to the end. Oh, but Finally. it does give you an option to view less. Yeah. <laughs> so you don't lose your mind all at the same time. <laughs> But if you go to our Facebook pages like that one, right? Or official salad. Or most of the time. Yeah. Or like this one has millions of people following it. Oh. I've done a lot of news on this one. Absolutely. There's videos. That's amazing. So. Well, sh well now I oh, have I everything. Have I have your no, you don't social have security everything. number. <laughs> You don't have everything. Your address. Shoe size. I'm going to come to your home. Who are you? Stalker you. Hi. Stalker no, bitch. God. I am not a stalker. Good. I have like such a hard time. Here's my issue. I love networking, yes. but I'm such a like down to earth social person that I don't. I'm still trying to find the balance of like, I don't know, like giving off. Like I'm a professional and I'm I'm selling myself, but I actually just want to be everybody's friend, you know. I'm listening everywhere you say. That's I am okay. For something you said, you keep talking. But it's you know what I mean. Yes. Like I feel like everybody. When's your birthday? In July 25th. Uh, you're a Leo. I'm a Leo. See. I have a very big personality, but I've I would noticed. much rather just be everybody's friend than like do I don't, something I don't for know me. That that's possible. Actually. I know. I've tried. Assholes and I don't get along well. Me neither. I fucking hate them. But. Uh, yeah. But here's the thing. If I, I meet an asshole further, and I'll, they're an asshole. I'll take with it me, a little further, though. If they fuck with me too much, I'll turn federal officials on their ass. Uh, well, I just see, have no patience for assholes. But, Kurt, I feel like you are able to do that. Well, it's phone calls. <laughs> Who do you need? The State Department, DOD, what do you the mean? White House? Yeah. <laughs> you uh, need the White House? Search anything you want. Let me I'm call Obama. We Let's will see. talk. Do, does he have the White House? Probably. Absolutely. Of course White. you do. White House. Oh. Oh. Whitson. No, it says Whitson. No, Hold go back. Hold it. Go back. Go back. White man. E. We want e. to go white. White. <laughs> you have no idea what's happening right now. Well, see the little click yes. means oh. that's the one you want. Oh. House. House. Hold on. All these people. Oh, came there up it in the White is. House, there she is. But these people all work for the White House. And that's James. why they came up. Hi, I'm. This Kurt. is Kurt Kelly. Kelly, This is my friend James. Nice to meet you. What do you do? 
I am a student currently. Where? At Noman School of Visual Effects. Who? Noman? A visual effects. I'm still getting over the no man part. <laughs> no man. So it's a woman's thing? No man? <laughs> no, no, no. no, it's a... Are there nomads? Nomads. Uh, nomadic for warriors. sure. Yes. You know what a nomad is. Yeah, you, you, know you know what a nomad is. Yeah. They just a nomad like... is, a, is, a, is basically, it's like a dial in the... Oh, a boxes. no man. I thought yeah. you said a no man. Yeah, no, no man. Both. I said, no do you know what a no man no, is? different. Both. You know what a no man is? Yeah, nomadic is a, is a traveler. Yeah, timeless traveler. Right. They just keep appearing in yeah, different like, places, kind of like myself. Like yeah. you, like Kirk Kelly. Like, like my the nomad. Is, nomadic world warrior you're looking for is Iron Maiden. That's, that's one of those things. Like, I actually know people in the band. Oh, really? Yeah, Kenny. Oh, oh cool. where, where do I put this? Where do I put this? Uh, not my job, man. I'm about the world. The Looks like people are stacking them up there on that oh, light switch. All right. That light yeah, switch man, that's over really there. cool, aren't we? Yeah. yeah. It's really cool. Yeah, I'm going over to his house and he's played for me before. In fact, he's kept me up all night doing shots and playing. It's like, dude, I'd like to sleep tonight. I right, pass out on the couch whenever you're right. Okay. Well, I've worked in rock and roll entertainment my entire life, so. Right, yeah. Yeah, I, I'm not from around here, from North Carolina. Uh, Ken Divinity, the big guy. Yeah. He was in Marat. Oh, really? Yeah. Are you on this? <coughs> Come here, I'll tell you something. Hey, Ken. This guy would like to meet you, because he'd like to meet the only guy who's ever been on film with his balls and dick in a guy's mouth and not being X-rated. <laughs> so he wanted to meet you down and brought in his balls and dick in a guy's mouth. You mean right But he had his balls and dick in a guy's mouth. Shadow He's proud of this fact. But that part's true. You should take me to life with six of them. Why? Instead of calling Lyft. You should write stuff. That's all. Just bring the couple I know that. I know that. But you're like that much older. He's trying to tell you something really fast. I made him shit his pants and ask him what happened. Ask him the time he rode with me. True story. And he was crying like a fucking baby. He couldn't shut the fuck up. It's like, can't shut up. No! You're gonna kill me! I'll wrap around a Excuse me. He was pissing himself. Literally. I never saw a grown man crying like him before. Yeah, I'm I'm like I'm I'm see. I drive really yeah, fast. I would absolutely love that. Well, I'll be a band. I drive I'll be a band. on average 131 to 150. Oh, But I, I've been trained as by NASA. I'll just let I know how to do that traffic. Most people are dying. Yeah. Literally. Right. 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 Yeah. 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 What table are you going to sit here? I will go in no, and out. No, oh, I don't know. I mean, I've got to get all these spaces. <laughs> Wait, yeah, like, like fucking I'm do it. They know who I am here. I don't know, man. I know. I'm done. But yeah. Excuse me, sir, you're not allowed back here. Yeah, I wish, right? Security, right? Yeah. All right, all right. Checking everything Kurt. out, make sure nobody's back at Jake. No, I haven't seen anybody going back there. Yeah, you check I was going to sneak back in and have a cigarette, actually. Yeah, that's, I'm going to do it, too, if you want to join me. Well, I was actually going to burn the joint. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to be really honest, Your Honor.
Detroit right people live here too. I forgot about that. This is all resident over here. So how do they get over here then? Uh, the stairwell of the basement. What? They'll yeah. go that far? Yeah. And come up? What, how many stories? 12? This is the 12th, yeah. This is actually technically the 13th. Oh, fuck it. Oh, man, that's desperation. Mm -hmm. Can't they find a stairwell over there to just smoke in? No, they just come up to try to get into the uh, oh. jazz. Well, why not just come through the front door? There's no, there's no cover charge. Thank you. Why be a... <laughs> that's a tight ass. Right? Yeah, I'll put on a jogging suit. I'll split my ass stack off <laughs> to get up there. Oh, it was free? You mean I didn't have to do all this shit? <laughs> yeah, we kicked a couple out earlier tonight. For doing that? Doing that, and they smuggled in their own bottle of wine. Which, oh. if you haven't noticed, there's no glass oh. allowed up oh. here. Well, that's not sativa. Oh, nice. It's all up. <laughs> Fire it up. Sharing is caring. Thank you. If you come across an extra beer of vodka, I won't complain either. <laughs> Not mandatory, never is. My throat is fucking fried. I went out to the desert to this like adult Burning Man. Okay. What's it called? No, uh, future. Further future. Okay. <laughs> in the middle of a fucking desert in an Indian reservation got lost because they didn't have exact address. They just had turn here, turn there. Sure. Got stuck. I, it hurts is going to fucking freak when we see a goddamn rental car. The bottom, the bottom end of this fucking Mustang, I swear the muffler must be a pancake. And the front frame is kind of loose on the front and on the rear. Kind of popped out. Oh, oh, what no. crash. But I mean, some of these holes were like on rocks, like six foot repeats to keep yeah. going through. And then you couldn't go back in the pouring rain 30 miles. Right. So by the time we, I finally got out and let the girl drive and I get out walk because those bumps on my balls were making me want to piss every 10 minutes. So it was just fucking a walk in the rain for a mile or two. Yeah, right. Oh my God. I go to a Joshua Tree Music Festival. No, I've never been to it. Oh, yeah. It's a. Uh... It's kind of like a Burning Man, but they limit the amount of people that can go. This had like 10,000 people. Yeah, this is, usually Joshua Tree has about 5,000 people. So it's more like you literally see everybody everywhere. So I have the roof down, I'm laying, sleeping out in the car because the girl's not pissed because the people who are supposed to stay there are people who want to stay there. And she's from Dutch and she's fucking crazy. I love her, but she's crazy. And she like chewed me out telling me I gotta shut the fuck up, I've been too stressed out, and I need to just shut up all this and all weekend to whatever she wants. Yeah. And so I try to humor her with this shit to the point where I get sick as a dog. Because I'm sleeping in the car at 10 in the morning with the top down, and she's off doing some shit wanting to be alone. And it starts pouring rain, so now I'm trying to put the top up. I already have walking to mode it. Now I'm getting chills, and then it's raining the rest of the oh. fucking day, and she's not coming back, so fuck it, she's not communicating. I go to try and get my credit card driven back on because I forgot to tell them it's on the stage, so they yeah. shut the fuck her off. Now I can't get a hotel room. She's not talking to me, and I'm ready to go back to LA. Well, no, come back, we'll get a room, we'll be fine, we'll be together. I get back and she's not coming, and it's like, hey, I'm getting ready to leave, I'm going back to LA. You can, oh no, I'll be there. She finally comes. Now she wants some time alone in the car so she can go through her stuff. She's packing all her stuff. Now she wants to stay, but she wants me to wait two more hours. I'm like, no, fuck this. Get your shit out of my car. I'm going home. Yeah, right? What the fuck? It's been fucking 36 hours with you. I haven't had time to sleep in most of the 36 hours aside from the car ride. You wanted to be alone. Fuck you. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. You want to be with other guys? Go be with another guy. I'll send you a fucking invoice for the car ride. I did for $500. I haven't, she hasn't paid it yet. But I'll also hit her with some legal action because when she grabs more of her shit, she grabs some of my stuff. Fucking bitch. That's why I put it in writing. You're stealing from me. You lied to me. You, and you told me when I came back you didn't even want to be there. You wanted to go. But now you're putting the pictures of what fun you're having in the desert. What's the truth, you fucking bitch? I mean, if I show you the audit trail, I'm going to pull you away. <laughs> what do you do? Television and film. So I get every fucking maggot there is on the planet. Hi. Okay. Specifically, I oh. call for, like, like, producing or directing? Or? Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. And acting and host and everything. I've done yeah, everything from for, Saturday Night Live to... Yeah, that's what I moved to here for, but I pushed it aside, actually. All right. Finances. I ended up uh, 
moved out about six years ago and needed money, and I ended up uh, where I was working. They offered me management, and I took it. And I worked it for five years, and they were working me 50 hours a week is what I was getting paid for, but I was putting in 75 to 80. Ow. Yeah, and so I said, fuck you, and I left. And now I came here, and I'm almost 30 busing. Three years old busing. I'm like... Never too late to start, though. Yeah. You didn't know that. Start hammering. I'm right back where I was. Finally, start hammering. Yeah. Well, if you start hammering and you land a couple, even if you're taking extra work, you can yeah. still work. Yeah. I got a buddy. Getting you on the set to network. Right. It's all about networking. But it was never really my dream. Just something I was good at in college and stuff. That's why I got my degree in. So. You know Ken Davidian? Yeah. Ask him to get you in on the set. Ask me. What's worse you gonna do? Say no. They won't do it if you don't ask. Right. They're going to read your mind. Oh, I really want that. You can't tell people what you want. Put it out there. Right. Been real good. Let's maybe Pleasure. see you back up here soon. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Thanks. Yeah. Open the door, man.
Remember? Remember this guy? Remember when we were at the Joseph's? Remember when we were at the Oh my god!
Which one? The one I just gave you. It's going to be about some Alaska leaders. Uh, we have 30 We have an actual Thank you. 
this shit gets shit done. They're coming in with $2 million. I have to argue with what the people. What do you do with this lower rates. Yep. What? Say that again. What do, do? Do? what do I do? Yeah. What do I do? I want to hear this. I what do hear. I do, Destiny? I want to hear the Brad thing. What do I do, Destiny? I don't even know what I do anymore. Glad you are. I'm in the club business. I was wondering what happened. Somewhere. Somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. I've been here. I've been there. I've been everywhere. But I haven't gone anywhere. Now I am going to be here, but I'm doing something. When you get a second, check out my website. You'll be very impressed. We just did a show with Bravo last week. Are you Apple or Android? I am an iPhone guy. I'm not going to All right, I'll have to send you my V card a different way. Okay. Anyway, you were saying? Yeah, we, we worked with Morgan for a lot. We shot something for Travel Channel. We just shot something for Bravo last week. We went week. to New Orleans. We, uh, we rediscovered the uh, Oysters Rockefeller and built it. So we have something called a gastro tank. We spent a lot of money, you and our brand. We, uh, we created something that we copyrighted. It's called a gastro tank. It's a savory brioche donut. It's blowtorch injected with nitrous fuel, blowtorch toppings. Everything from butter poached lobster. Sir, what's a s'more? And we, uh, my whole team of guys that do this, look like they're working in a garage. They're all in welding masks and blow torches. It's crazy. People go nuts. I do events for everything from Avengers, the Fox, American Idol, to everything. We, we're all over the place. People go nuts for what we're doing. We're gonna open a freaking quarter soon. But the team, we've got literally everybody from Ryan. You two should meet before she runs to the bathroom. She's producing right. films. I've known her for years. Do a lot of events, but now he also does catering for events. Oh, okay. Yes. High end stuff. Yes, I do high end stuff. I have some great gas in the garage. We deconstruct classic sandwiches and dishes. And we reconstruct it. We do pop ups and events. We're going to have a location okay. soon. We're out of like four bars to meet every Friday and Saturday. We do okay. a couple of different other locations. But we're with CAA, we've been working on a TV show for a while. We, our production company was Spurlock, we was Spurlock's Warrior Poets. Yeah, yeah. We've been offering what you For what exactly? What you were looking for? You were looking for new production company, what you were looking for? I don't know the answer to that so question. So the TV show you're trying to do, is it picked up? Are you still producing it? We did not get picked up. We haven't been picked up. We didn't send you my videos and all that stuff. Yeah, we don't do anything under two million, but I know what your networks are looking for. So if you got what's your content on? Shoot me a text. Are I'm going to shoot you. Oh, I just got it. Yeah. And I will. I will show you all my videos and my bra what I did for Bravo. She, she has a question. Yeah, send that. I want to see what. Uh, show me a sizzle reel. Yep. Maybe what you pick up. Awesome. I guess I know I, I still have to go to the bathroom, but I was just wondering. Go ahead. I was just going to say, you didn't get picked up. Who did you pitch to? What network? We, our first initial concept was pitched to everybody. Okay. For the most part. Travel Channel actually paid us to go to New Orleans and shoot like a 17 minute video. So they didn't, but they didn't produce the pilot. What happened was when we came back, uh, as you probably know, Travel Channel got bought. Yeah. yeah. And everybody who paid us to go and do that got yeah, turned over. Yeah, okay, so okay, okay. then we got down to one of six shows that they were going to pick up, and they passed. So you, but you still own that footage. Like, what do they own? To some degree. I own, I, I'm some allowed to use it to shop, but I couldn't sell that footage. Well, yeah, but you can still stuff. use it. You can still put it in. I can use it for, for shopping. For yeah. Sure. I will send you what we got. Okay. Well, we have like this really like cool better idea for like uh, it's sort of like the monkeys meet. So you haven't actually shot the pilot. We have 17 have. minutes worth of video in your one. I have a 17 minutes. Did you get someone to edit it? Or your poets already edited. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. We have okay. something that's awesome to show people, got it, got but it, we got have it. to start over. Yeah. With fine, that's fine, that's fine. I have a 17-minute video and I have a five-minute video. Two different concepts. Both from more Two different concepts. The 17-minute video is more like, kind of like uh, Anthony Bourdain or Andrew Zimmerman go to new cities and, and then show the five what we do. Was. It's a little bit more like reality TV, kind of. A little bit about us. 